Hello and welcome to Westwood News Now. I'm your host, Charlotte Lynch, here to recap and preview all things Westwood. Westwood Winds Community Band will be hosting their free annual summer concert on Monday, August 5th at 6.30 p.m. at Westwood High School. The family-friendly concert will take place under the open sky and will have a Mediterranean theme with a variety of fun and lively pieces from Spain, Italy, and England. More information about Westwood Winds may be found on its website. The Westwood Food Pantry is putting out a call for donations. Their pop-up food drive will be held at the Roach Brothers and the Council on Aging. All non-perishable food items are accepted with specific needs for cereal, cooking oils, canned pasta, ramen, soap, and paper products. Westwood Media Center will be live streaming and televising Tuesday's planning board meeting next week. Our YouTube channel has a library of government meetings, sports games, lectures, special events, and so much more. The Board of Health announced on Tuesday that West Nile virus has been detected in mosquitoes in Westwood. Here's Health Director Jared Orsini with more information. We were informed by DPH that a trap in Westwood contained a mosquito that was positive for the West Nile virus. So that raised our level uh, of awareness from low to moderate. So when we're at moderate risk, what we want to do is remind people to take the basic precautions, use an EPA registered insect repellent such as DEET when they go outside to limit their time outdoors during peak mosquito time, which is dawn and dusk as much as possible. When they are out during dawn and dusk, we would like for people to consider wearing light, loose fitting clothing, pants and long shirts um, as a way to protect themselves from bites. And also importantly to sort of try to stay away from places where you have a high mosquito population um, in a breeding ground. So you wanna basically take a few minutes. If you see you're in an area where there's a lot of mosquitoes around, you wanna probably uh, plan to move somewhere else when you're outside doing your recreation. Lastly, look for areas around your home where there's standing water any standing water that you find in old, you know, gardening pots or in a wheelbarrow, things like that should be should be turned over and emptied. The Westwood Council on Aging and Westwood Youth and Family Services is starting their intergenerational program again. Westwood Rights pairs students and seniors together as pen pals throughout the year. For more information, contact Adina Swan at Youth and Family Services or stop by the Senior Center for an application. Westwood fifth grader Alex Kiyami received first place in the Spring Invest Right Competition's elementary division. Kiyami wrote an essay for an optional contest that is a part of the stock market game, where students learn financial literacy by playing a fictional stock market. Kiyami's essay focused on taking a 25000 investment and earning enough to pay for a college education. That will do it for us here at Westwood News Now. New episodes premiere every Friday, so tune in to us next week for more news. Thank you for watching.